for our ongoing class. Ha! Huh, it's a solo for the girl from Ipanema. Partial, it's a solo and a partial chord melody. We're in the key of C. And we identified the notes that we're going to do chord melody over. It's D, B, B, A, D, B, 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 A, or some variation like that. Tall and tall and tan and young and lovely the sing the words to help yourself out tall and tan and young and lovely the and we're even though in the chart it's a c major seven we're gonna we're just gonna make it a regular old c and all we have to do <laughs> is drum the open g c and e strings and make our melody with the a string so one way we can do it is i call it a rhythmic a chord melody or i'm just going you hear that or let's do a block chord and then single notes Block, ba, single notes. Ba, 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 ba. I'm, and I'm in my finger picking position to make that block chord with my right hand. And then I'm using my ring finger to pick the single notes. Let's try that. Two, three, four. Let's try the rhythmic style. Two, three, four. Fun. And the rest of it, we're going to improvise. We have a, a D13. We can do a D7. So a uh, D13 looks like this. But we can start with a D7 and then add on the A string the B note and the C note for some variation, which is improvising or finger pick picking. And then the last part of this solo is our uh, D minor 7 to a G9, which we're doing this, this form here. And because it's a movable form, we're covering all four strings. Now we can add some muting rhythmic embellishments here, like this. Here's the D minor 7, G9, G9. All sorts of possibilities. Let's just put it together. Okay. One, two, three, four. Yeah, and I mentioned at the end when we hit that uh, C major 7, we've been talking about the pentatonic scale. Let me show you how we can put that in. So we're doing the da, C, Instead of starting on a C note with that pentatonic, I'm starting where we're at, which is that C major 7, and seeing what notes we want to fit into the space that we've got. Let's try this from the top of the solo. One, two, three, four. What 
I do? I just did the pentatonic scale. I went down in pitch, and then I made a circle and came back up. See, so you could do. You can take one or two notes of the pentatonic scale and stretch them out. Uh, the difference here, we learn the pentatonic scale, doing the C, A, G, E, D, C, A, G. We are tweaking it a little bit to fit into this song as a fill. We're starting with the C major seven, starting with the B. That's the only difference. See how we can kind of nip and tuck that uh, pentatonic scale. Let's try this one more time. A one, two, three, four. Turn this thing off.